Hello everybody, and anybody who's watching this video, I hope that you are having a good day, or night, or afternoon, whatever. I hope you're having a good whatever it is that you're having, okay? So, I'll address what I consider the elephant in the room, which you might not have even noticed. I'm looking a little crazy today. I just got done with doing my Morticia Adams cosplay. It's on my Instagram. It's here on YouTube if you want to see. But that means that my eyebrows are black and my lips are bright red and I have like smoky makeup and the nails are aggressive. So to me, I look a little funky, a little crazy. But I wanted to film this video now because it's a haul video and I want to start putting these products where they go within my home and using them and I don't want to do that before the haul. So, yada yada, you get it. Also, this may or may not be the first video with the hair dyed pink. Um, even though it's been pink for over a week and it's actually fading at this point, but I couldn't film for a whole week because of personal reasons. I'm not going to get into it. I gotta get into the haul. We're almost two minutes in and you haven't seen anything. So I've got some drugstore stuff, um, some TJ Maxx, some Spirit Halloween, I think one item from Walmart. It's just a mix of stuff. I'm going to show it to you, okay? This is what's from Walmart. It's not that exciting, but I can tap on it. So this is a hair straightener. And this is because I lost my hair straightener when I moved. And maybe it'll appear and I'll have two hair straighteners. Also, it's been like nine months since I moved. But I don't straighten my hair. Honestly, I don't I don't really do anything to my hair. I mean, I occasionally re-dye it pink, but there's not much that I do. Um so I forgot. That straighteners are even useful to have. But there were a couple of hairstyles that I saw on the internet. TikTok, I know. But made me think I need to get a straightener. So this was at Walmart and it was the cheapest one that wasn't a miniature one like for your bangs only, although the hairstyles I wanted to create, I probably could have just gotten like a miniature one, because like I want to do the little like braided cat ears and they straighten it so they stay up, or the little flip up devil horns, that's what I want to do. If you don't know what I'm talking about, this is probably too confusing. I'm gonna ramble a lot, I haven't recorded like I said in a week. So I miss you guys. I'm gonna be talking. I'm gonna be taking my sweet time. I really wanted to do a Halloween themed video. I mean I did a Morticia Adams video but I wanted to do a Halloween themed video because I, you know, it's the one time of year we can really up that up that amount. So well I might hold this video off until after Halloween but I also might not care at all. So, let's move on. Okay. Try not to crinkle and crumple too much. Okay, this is from, honestly, I said the drugstore, but it's from my grocery store. Um, I know you can get it at Target too. Um, actually, it's not even from my grocery store. It's from a grocery store. 
across the Kroger, which I know does not exist everywhere, but I have Kroger's where I'm at, so anyway, it's lotion. It's lotion that I once again heard about on the internet. I heard that it was like the U.S. has really good lotion and shaving cream. the shaving cream and the lotion um and honestly i have shaving cream i'm almost out of it though i have lotion so i did not need these um i think i just wanted to spend money because i felt bad um but anyway the packaging is cute too this is like almost my favorite shade of pink which is my favorite color i haven't sniffed it yet because like i said i haven't unpackaged this stuff because i wanted to do a haul we're gonna sniff it together oh it smells so good i also have sensitive skin if you look closely which don't look don't report me but if you look closely you can see that i am mid allergic reaction which I have been having for the last four or so days. Um, and I don't know what it's to, but I'm allergic to so much stuff. Um, I was out of town and I think it might have been the sheets that I was on. Because almost the whole time I was out of town. So it might have been those and I'm still coming down from it. It could have been in something else. I don't know. And there's a chance I'm allergic to this. It, all that to say, I'm allergic to a lot. There's a chance I'm allergic to this and this. Um, and I'll just pawn it off on some loved one if I am, but I'm gonna try it. It's got shea butter, which I know shea butter products are like really good for your skin and hair. So I don't know if this is shea butter. This does. Okay. So I'm going to try them. The packaging's cute. This one's lavender scented. I don't know if I can smell it. I can. I'm not big on lavender scent, mostly because it reminds me of my mom who really liked it when I was a kid. But my partner likes lavender and they honestly, they use the shaving cream more than me. So, you know. The other thing I got from the grocery store is shampoo and conditioner. I um, was looking at different people who know more than me. Like I said, I don't know anything about my hair and I don't do anything with my hair. And it's a mess because it was just in a wig. Like I said, I was in cosplayer before this, but I'm trying to be better to my hair. So I was looking up cheap, shim, cheaper shampoo and conditioners that aren't bad for your hair because I know so many of them are apparently bad for your hair. Like I said, I don't know enough on the topic, but somebody said that the L'Oreal Everpure Bond Strengthening is really good for your hair, especially if you have bleached hair, which under the pink is of course bleached. So I'm going to try these. I'm not going to try them until I run out of the shampoo and conditioner I'm using because I'm not wasteful. I'm not throwing it out, you know? So I use Dove Color Care sh uh, conditioner or shampoo and conditioner or Dove Color Care shampoo and Dove Daily Moisture conditioner. Maybe that's it. That's what I use right now, but when I run out of it, I'm switching to the L'Oreal, unless I am allergic to it. Stay with me. I think that was the last thing from Kroger, so I'm going to move on to TJ Maxx. And this is a bunch of Hello Kitty stuff, so if you love Hello Kitty, Sanrio, in general. 
Hello lip balm. Now I have the Rainbow Sherbert Hello Kitty lip balm, and honestly, these lip balms are not very good. The texture of them is really waxy. But it's just so cute. Come on. Is that loud? I wanted to smell it. Look, there's vitamin E in it for your lips. I got this because it's cute. Not because it's going to be good for me. But, you know. Maybe this one's better than the other ones. I don't know. Hair balm. Okay. It smells really good. It's caramel pudding. It smells so good. I do love. It's hard to tell, because I have lipstick on, how it actually feels. But maybe it will be good, and maybe I was a fool. Before I put it on crooked. There we go. Also... Okay, okay. This is chaotic. I'm sorry. I want you to relax. Oh, I'm sorry that I'm a mess. Almost everything I show, there is going to be the comment that I might be allergic to it. So just bear with me. I'm allergic to a lot. Same brand, the Creme Shop. I think that's how you say it. It might not be. Um, this is a setting spray, a mattifying setting spray. It's oil absorbing. I am not oily though. I'm pretty dry. Although, that breakout might be oily. Um, it's strawberry scented though, and it has my melody on it, so I bought it. It feels like it. It smells like alcohol, not like strawberries. Give me a second. Ingredient is alcohol, so that would do it. Um, I guess that's why it's gonna dry out the oils because the alcohol. I think I'm gonna spray it on my arm. I really do not smell strawberry. Maybe a sweet sort of sweet, generally sweet smell, but not strawberry specifically. Well, we'll see if it works. We'll see if it's good. I almost never use setting spray. I forget about it. So, maybe if it's really cute, I'll actually use it. It might not work. Okay. Now this I got because I got a hair straightener. And if I'm going to use that hair straightener, I'm going to need heat protectant. So this is Iron Garden Thermal Protection Spray, but you might notice the other reason. I got this specific heat protection. It's because it's Barbie and it's pink. I'm predictable, okay? And I'm fine with that. You know that I'm the easiest person in the world to buy gifts for. My birthday is coming up. It's next month. Less than a month away. And I am so easy to find gifts for. So, I don't know what I'm talking about there. I know I had a point, but I forgot my point. Anyway, okay, ignore the birthday talk. I don't know why I brought it up. Okay, Barbie, and it's a heat protectant. I don't know if this is a good brand of heat protectant, but it's better than not using a heat protectant, I assume. So, I have it now. I feel like I used to have a heat protectant, um, but I don't, I don't, uh, but I also have a straightener and I don't now. So, well, I do, but I don't have that on for Anyway, this is like the only thing 
That is not Hello well, Sanrio that I got from TJ Maxx. Minus the Barbie. Barbie's not Sanrio, but it is the same vibe. And honestly, this is the same vibe too. This is strawberry lip oil. Now, it says lip gloss, but then it says lip oil. Which one is it? I don't know. I'm thinking it's a lip oil though, because it says soothing and moisturizing. And I want something that's going to soothe me and moisturize me. So, that's that. That's the goal. Uh, maybe it'll taste good. And maybe, just maybe, I'll be allergic. So, um, two more things. These are both actually Hello Kitty, not just in Rio. It's a hand cream, and it's apple blossom scented, which I don't know the difference between apple scented and apple blossom scented. Maybe it's more floral, um, but apple scented things are, it's like my favorite smell is apple smells, and it's really hard to find. I mean, it's easy to find, um, apple scented candles, so a lot of those, but also they usually are apple cinnamon, which is good, but not the smell that I like most. I like the fresh apple smell. So this is apple blossom scented hand lotion. And it's the same brand again, the Creme Shop. Because they have all this Hello Kitty stuff. That's the Creme Shop brand of TJ Maxx. We're going to smell it. Look at how cute it is. If I'm allergic, it doesn't matter. It's going to gonna sit on the counter in my bathroom downstairs and if guests come over and feel like wow my hands sure are parched maybe they'll use it sealed that's a good sign oh seal's kind of broken though and it's leaking so maybe it's not a good i've gotten it oh it smells good oh it does smell like fresh apples and a little bit floral oh Um, I'm not gonna squirt any more of it. It smells good. And it's so cute. Oh my goodness. Look at me. Shea butter again. I'm on a roll with shea butter. So shea butter and vitamin E to nourish me in the dry skin. Apple and rose. Okay, so it is, like I said, apple scented with a little bit of floral. I like rose smells, too. I'm almost done with the beauty products, and then I'll get into the Spirit Halloween stuff. But I did not get spooky stuff from Spirit Halloween. I got stuff that matches my aesthetic, which I know I'm not dressed in my aesthetic right now. So if you do not watch me regularly, you might not understand. But maybe the Hello Kitty and Barbie stuff can give you a hint. My aesthetic is like this, you know? My aesthetic is like this. She's a pirate. Okay? My aesthetic is like this, you know? But the last thing from TJ Maxx, because I'm getting ahead of myself, is Hello Kitty. The Creme Shop, my best friend. These are gel eye masks. And I'm uh, pretty sure you put them in the refrigerator, the freezer, or the microwave to either warm or cool your eyes. I don't know why you're supposed to warm or cool. I think cooling your eyes depuffs them, but I don't recall ever looking in the mirror and thinking, gosh, my eyes are just puffed today. Um... I'm sorry if this isn't relatable content. I don't know what puffy eyes are or need, unless like I'm having an allergic reaction and they're puffed up, which maybe that is what they're for, but people act like they're for a regular skincare routine. So maybe I don't understand anything. I don't know what warm, warming your eyes would do. Comfort? Okay. 
okay? I don't know. I know nothing. I don't know about hair care. I don't know about skin care. I barely know about makeup. I'm doing my best. Um, I like all of those things. I'm just kind of dumb. So, eye masks. These are adorable. A little glitter. Sometimes I just need to feel something. Okay. Let's move on. Spirit Halloween. There's only like three more things. And they're just because I thought they were cute. So. Alright. These were being sold at Spirit Halloween. Buy the Powerpuff Girl costumes. And best believe. I am going to try my hardest on November 2nd to go over there when the costumes are on sale and buy costumes. And one of the costumes I'm going to try and buy is Powerpuff Girls. But these are cute. These are cute and they're definitely my style and I would definitely wear them all year round and nothing about them screams Halloween to me. Um, I just think they're cute, and I'm gonna wear them some other time. I love Powerpuff Girls. I love Powerpuff Girls. So, this is a, this is a win. This is quite a find. One of the things to me that is evident that people, especially people where I am from, I live in the southern United States, think that I dress weird, because like I said, I don't usually dress like this. I dress a lot in like all pink, pastel colors, and glitter, and sparkle, and blah, okay? But one of those things that is evident to me that I dress weird uh, is because stuff that I would wear constantly, all the time, on a regular day, is sold as costume pieces. For example, this is a costume. This is not, this is normal to me. This is definitely a, looks like several other pieces of jewelry that I own. It's adorable. I don't have anything that just like this, but look at the mink cream. How cute. Little holographic flower, the gemstone. This is adorable. Shout out to Spirit Halloween. Shout out to Spirit Halloween. These would look good together. Do like a bubbles sort of look. I have some hair clips with bubbles on them. Like with bubbles from Powerpuff Girls, not and the last thing for this whole video, and then I will leave you be. There's two. It's socks. It's, it's beautiful. A beautiful shade of lavender. And that is a beautiful, like the prime shade of pink. And they're just being sold as parts to a costume. Like maybe you're dressing as a cheerleader. No, no, I'm gonna wear these every day. I love knee socks. I'm wearing knee socks right now. I'm not going to, I'm not wearing pants, so I'm not gonna show you. But I wear knee socks a lot. They're comfortable, they're warm, and they're cute. And these colors. Thank you, Spirit Halloween. Thank you, DJ Max. And thank you for being here and for watching this video. I know I'm just chaotic. Just a little bit. A little rambly. A little all over the place. I'm a little out of it. Like I said, I've had some stuff in my life going on. Actually, one thing after another. Just a But I'm making it through it and I'm fine. Um, and I hope that you're okay, too. And I hope that you're good. 
Um, I hope you're more than okay. I hope you're wonderful.